Cool. Okay, well, we spawned on an island. Um, hello guys. <laughs> it's been a hot minute since I've played all the mods 9. And I think since the last time I looked at it, there's probably been 200 plus mods added in. So, I figured rather than try and catch up on my old series that I was recording, I would just start completely fresh. Um, so... Yeah, there's also a quest line that's been added in, which I'm not going to look at in this first episode. Um, I'll poke off some of the rewards that we collect along the way, but for the most part, I'm just going to concentrate on setting myself up. Finding somewhere to at least settle down for a starter base. And like this, this island doesn't seem like a bad idea if we can get the whole place lit up with torches. Um, that's kind of cute that we spawned on an island, I'm not going to lie. Oh, and there's butterflies. Hello. I'm afraid I am going to need, uh, I might need to boop some horses. Because we all know that I can't live without backpacks. And backpacks require leather. Uh. I might not attack the horses that are on this island to start with. I might just leave them be. Can we? Oh, food straight away. Awesome. That's amazing. We'll have a little look around. But I'm thinking it might not be a bad idea to stay on this island. Now, all in all, there are an absolute ton of mods in here that I'm I'm not going to have any clue on. I genuinely won't know. Like this, what I I never used Greg Tech, ever. So <laughs> maybe what I'll do is try and do some learning in between episodes, and then have like an episode like dedicated to learning or putting into practice what I've learnt. For that particular mod pack. But for now we'll do all of the basics. We'll we'll get ourselves set up with you know the pickaxes and the swords and things. Yeah, I can see that we are completing quests off. Okay, well, I probably won't read much of this out loud in this episode, but if you want to pause and have a read of things, they are there. Oh, okay, and we have little um, experience boxes. I will tick that off later, just in case it gives me something random that I don't need to have in my inventory. Because you know for a fact that my inventory is going to get very full, very quick, of <laughs> random rubbish, because that's just how I work. Thinking we should go up here... Oh, I might go and... Yeah, we'll go grab some of that little purple tree for sure. That I think if I'm not mistaken, I don't know how to pronounce it. It's, I'm not sure. I think it's pronounced jacaranda. I'm not confident. Please correct me if I'm wrong. Um, oh, coal. Awesome. We'll go and get some of that wood. I believe it's a pale purple. Which would be quite cute. Okay, we're up. Oh, I know that the salt. Um, these are going to be useful. So we will take those. Oh, little bumblebee. Oh, wow. Okay, this is the, the lavender fields.
All right, if I'm not mistaken, that's from Biomes of Plenty? Biomes you go, Biomes you go. Honestly, can't remember. I'm an idiot. Don't don't mind me. But I'm afraid we're going to um, Madurja all but two of these cows. There's leather. Alright, there's our four pieces of leather. I'm not going to destroy any more cows. Oil sands. Sorry, I'm probably going to get very distracted in uh, in a lot of the episodes to start with because, there's, like I said, there's just so much in this now that... Oh, hello, snail. I just don't know about. Can we find any sheep? We're going to need some sheep. I hear lava. Oh, what are you? Are you... Oh. Are you friendly? I think it's friendly. Alright, I want to go and steal some leaves. Thank you. Oh, crikey, the day is really getting on, isn't it? Um, can we find some sheep? We have food, we can run around a bit. Oh look, if push comes to shove, we can spend the night in this tower. I would rather find some sheep though. We can sleep it away at the very least. And I'm fully aware that that tower is quite possibly booby trapped. Um, I will go and investigate it. But I will make sure to check for traps first. I've, I've played something similar before and uh, yeah it, it blew up in my face sheep hello no sheep i see chickens okay well we're going to be spending our first night in this building over here let's not die up here that'll be a good idea <laughs> yeah. No thank you. Shimmer. We'll take that and the bucket. A lightning gem. Gives this arrow velocity, mining speed, or just speed. I mean, any of those sound pretty good. Fortune 2, yes please. And fire aspect, also not bad. I will take all of that, thank you. Um, And I might even take all of the books. It saves me having to make some later. And that. As you know for a fact, I'm going to be using the Bosni pots. Okay. Um I'm just gonna camp out here for the night now. So I'll uh, I'll check back in with you guys in the morning. There is our sunshine. Glorious as it may be. We're going to grab these on the way down and hope there are no creepers. Nope, we are good. Okay, awesome. I am still convinced that this shrubland over here will be home to some sheepies. when we get up here and also whilst i was thinking away my time looking at the stars i noticed this tree 
for the archwood it glows so i'm wondering if it'd be a nice light source for the island as well we can take some of those home excuse me tree can i make you naked uh we do not need a blue flower green tea leaves we don't need you either uh or an acorn that space can be reserved for sheep or wool rather i hear you hello uh cows yes i'm kind of feeling like i want to grab a white sheep i think that that might be a little bit more easy to find <coughs> Okay, we're home. Yay. Oh. <laughs> we already have a yellow tree. Well, that's fine. Mini melons. Adorable. Oh, we have a green tree. Yay. Okay, I'm happy about that. Why did I not pay attention to this before? I hope the green tree glows as well. That would be pretty awesome. Okay, let's set up... Hmm... You know what, we'll just make a little base camp down here. Set up the very basics. Like our bed. And did I have any more logs on me? I do not. That's okay. Eh. <laughs> Are you supervising? Oh, you wanted to come under here to get out of the rain, I see. Well, I do apologise. I have removed your shelter. First night's sleep. There we go. Okay, mission for today. Mob proof the island as much as possible. And clear out all of this grass. So, um, I don't know, do we just cue a montage of me clearing out all the seeds or? <laughs> Three, two, one, go! Okay, this whole island is going to take way too long. Um, that was a rather ambitious thing of me. However, we do have a heap of stuff now though. So I'm looking for industrial hemp seeds because they're going to help us make string to make the backpacks and fishing rods and stuff like that. I was thinking of using flax seeds, but I'm not sure. I think the hemp might possibly grow faster not confident on that one but we'll see and i also realized that you know i could just use these instead of the jacaranda so let's make a hoe cool all right oh we have a bucket actually we could bring bring some water up I might plant it just up here for now, just so it's got easy access. Oh! Wait, what? <laughs> okay, that's new! Uh, we've got one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay. Oh! 
hello. Uh -huh. Snow blossom sapling. That looks like it could be pretty. Huh. Oh, so really? <laughs> That's just teasing me. Huh. No, go away. Not impressed. Okay, well clearly we didn't put any torches anywhere. Well, that's, that's fine. We have charcoal on the way. Let's get another good night's sleep. Excuse me, llamas. You're gonna just keep getting in my way, aren't you? I will have to evict you. Why are you living in my plants? Murderous Acts of the God King. <laughs> I didn't realize this had a name. 21% crit damage. Wow. Okay. That. Yep. That tracks. Okay. I'm going to do some mining. Going to get a bunch of cobble for some stone pickaxes. No, stone axes. And then I'm going to have to go over there and get all of the wood that I want. And whilst I'm chopping that, I can have a little think on a cute little house idea. Maybe flatten this section off here. And just pop a house down. Let's be off to go and get three axes worth of purple wood. Oh, I didn't pay attention to my hunger. I forgot that FTB Ultimine saps your hunger. Okay. This is going to be a great vantage point for checking in on the progress of how the, uh, how the base is looking. Not even going to try and pronounce that word. Oh, that was a mistake. Don't do that. Oh, wow. That was a mistake. I forgot I couldn't jump. Uh, couldn't run. That one's on me. Oh, what an idiot. What I'm going to do... I'm going to stop for a moment. I'm going to go and make myself some lunch IRL. I am getting quite hungry. And whilst I'm having lunch, I will have a think on what sort of little house I want to build. It's going to be a very, very basic. So it's been a couple of hours and I ended up going into a creative world and just playing around with the build palette that I'm going to have available to me. But I'm going to need stone bricks. Oh, hello, you grew. But instead of digging out underneath my island, I think I'm going to go over here somewhere. Oh, hello, what's this? Okay. I'm going to go over here somewhere and start a little mine underneath that hillside. Kind of makes a little bit more sense to me. So, first things first. A bunch of picks. Okie dokie. Well, we find out three stripes. And I've got four stacks of cobble, some some copper, and I found a bit of tin and sulfur. Don't know what I'm doing with those if I'm honest with you. So let's go grab some coal. Oh, well, never mind. We have a little bit, that's fine. We can always get some charcoal as well. Get a spoon, and we're going to level this right down to here. 
this level here. Now, we're going to do... I think I have it designed as a 5x8 five, five, interior. Okay, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1... Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's essentially going to have like one, two, barrel, one, two, barrel, one, two. And then the same on this side. And yeah, double layered and that. Okay, so I wanted to do the stripped archwood because it kind of makes it look a little bit more weathered, which I quite like. So we're going to have a nice wrap around. saying if you get in the way of my axe it's not my fault As you can tell, I'm not exactly the most organised of people when I'm building. Oh, didn't think about this today. in here. So I'm going to put this in now before I put the ceiling on. And eventually it will have a lantern on it. But right now we don't have any Also wanted to make is it this way around? Yes. Safety rail. three here. Now one there, one there. The window is here on this one. Twos. Now this is going to look <laughs> quite messy in a moment, so uh one, two, three. I think I have these four. Whoops.
this looks so chaotic right now. Okay, where are we at so far? Let's have a look at this. It's it's coming along. I'm gonna put some torches around for now, just where where was I going to have I think it's every other I'm going to have there we go. Oh, see how much this brightens up. Oh, it's a shame I don't have a piece of iron to make the um what should we call it? My brain's gone burp. Can't remember. Stone cutter. That's the word I'm looking for. <laughs> it's not going to stay there, but let's just pop that there for a moment. I see the dawn coming. Okay, we have a roof. Good job. And I had. that with that there's going to be so much storage in here it's going to be ridiculous but considering how many mods there are I, maybe it's not that ridiculous So much storage! Okay, this is <laughs> the basics almost complete of uh, of where I was up to. I really didn't get like a huge, huge way through it. Um, I genuinely don't know how to decorate this portion, but we'll work it out. We'll we'll come across some stuff eventually. Um, should probably move some of this stuff inside. To be honest with you, let's. Finish these off. There was one there, and there's going to be a lantern there, so... For now I'm just going to put torches there so I can remember to put the lanterns later. Oh! Speak actually! No, guys! The copper stuff! Can we make... Copper lanterns? We can! Oh! We're going to make copper lanterns! Lanterns! Oh, yeah, that was 12. That's not quite how many I wanted, but that's fine. <laughs> These are so cute. It. I actually love it. It's so cute. Kind of feel like this is this is a safe place. We'll sleep, and um, I'll see you in the next one, guys. Thank you for watching. And goodbye, guys. 
I'm back. I did a dumb. <laughs> I forgot that we were supposed to be looking at all of the quest items before I finish the episode. So let's find out what we want. We might as well accept this now that we have storage space. And the beginning. We didn't get a huge amount through the beginning, but that's fine. And what are we going to get out of this one? A wolf spawn egg. Okay. And this one, a basic pipe upgrade. Haven't played around with that, so okay. Um, food and farming. Scrambled eggs, I'll take it. Quite like scrambled eggs. Um, mystical. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, so because I found the tin, I've unlocked the Thermalpedia. Okay, good to know. Dreaming of Demons. This is a mod that I have zero experience with. <laughs> this little guy looks quite cute, though. Okay, I believe that's everything. Yes, okay, awesome. That is everything. So, you know, it's quite cute that we've got a wolf spawn egg. I hope that spawns in tame. That would be very cool. So yeah, I'm going to chuck all of that in there for now. Say thank you again. And uh, I hope to catch you in the next one where we've finally decided what we're going to do. But I uh, hope you like the little house. Sorry this first episode was a bit chaotic. I need to get back into the swing of things. But yes, I will definitely catch you next time, guys. Goodbye!